بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر ویئرس ویلکم ٹو مائی یوٹیوب چینل ٹی جی لرنر پوائنٹ ٹو ڈے ویڈیو کور دا سلوشن آف اسائنمنٹ نمبر ون ریڈی ٹو کاپریٹ فنانس وچ ہے سبجیکٹ فور ٹین سکس ٹو ٹو اینڈ اس ٹوٹل مارکس آر ٹین اینڈ اس کلاس ڈیٹ فار سبمیشن از تھرٹی فرسٹ اگست ٹوینٹی ٹوینٹی ٹو سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ Inventory management is an important topic in working capital management process because it provides insight to management in making decisions, especially in manufacturing entities. A variety of factors should be kept in mind during the inventory management as these factors are crucial for profitability and sustainability of any manufacturing entity or business. These factors can be categorized into nature of inventory, stock, out cost, economic order point, lead time and economic order quantity. Economic order quantity determines the number of orders that minimizes total variables and holding costs. Thus, bringing the economy of inventory by choosing the optimal inventory level, if the objective of EOQ are achieved, a business can reduce its inventory transporting and storing cost and tackle the disastrous effects of stock out issue sufficiently. This paragraph is an introductory paragraph that gives you information about the inventory management uh, in context of some uh, different factors such as uh, stock out cost and uh, economic other point and uh, economic lead time and economic order quantity and the capability of the business entity to manage in a more efficient way is a key role in increasing the profitability of the business. So suppose you are in you are an inventory manager and management provided the information of inventory of the two firms for analysis. Firm A is your firm in which you are doing job and firm B is its competing firm. Firm A has almost constant demand and costs like ordering and holding costs. But firm B has seasonality factors which result in varying demand and cost in analysis time. The two factors that you have to be noticed in this uh, scenario is that manager, inventory manager is working in firm A and it has constant demand and cost like ordering and holding cost while the firm B which, which is its company's competitor has varying demand but lead time and other things are constant but variation regarding demand and cost in analysis time. So, your major objective is to provide the EOQ, economic order quantity, stock out cost and economic order point of both funds and comments in which firm the EOQ is appropriate along with reason. So, uh, what is your job? Your job is to determine EOQ, stock out cost and EOP for both funds and on the basis of EOQ, you have to be decided which firm is appropriate and provide some logical reasoning in support of your decision. The following table shows information regarding accounts needed for the calculation. Annual demand in KG 112,000 for firm B 120,000. Cost per orders 6. Uh, 100, 643 and 620 and there is a variation as, as, as already have mentioned in the question that for, for from B the quantity to money and demand and cost per others are in variation mode while the same things are our factors are constant in case of from A so now come to the annual consumptions 112,000 and 120,000.
Now you need to find order quantity in kg. Here is a question mark in both sides. Stock out in kg 2200. 2, Stock out unit cost rupees 18 and 16. Accept it. Probability of stock out percentage 0 0.1. 0 0.1. I think it's 0 0.01 and 0 0.01 in decimal form. Consumption period per period kg 9300 and 9800. Lead time per month 0 0.25. 0 0.25. And see here as per con condition described in this question, lead time is constant for four firms, but there is a variation regarding uh, demand and cost and cost per order. The last information is talk out acceptance factor in percentage 1.1, 1.1, also same. And in decimal form, it is 0 .0, 0 0.011 and 0 0.11. There is a hint given to you, order quantity here, which is missing from the table. And economic order quantity are same. So, requirement, calculate the economic order quantity stock out cost, safety stock and economic order point from the given data. B task in which firm EOQ is appropriate and provide better prediction and what is the reason behind selection. Without wasting time, I am going to the my solution file which I have made on Excel. So here is the data given in double dated form in front of you. So here I impose a condition. Constant demand and constant lead time, variable demand and uh, cost something another, but the lead time is also constant. So formula that I am going to use here is economic order quantity is k root into 2 into d into k into h annual uh, consumption k cost per order and H stands for holding cost per unit. So, here is a formula and here is a solution. See, here is the annual consumption which is which is available in D5, this one annual demand sorry annual demand please make some correction in formula instead of d5 we are going to use this d8 annual consumption because on the basis of annual consumption we are going to place a new order not on demand as demand increases we increase our consumption so, but in our case, this is same annual demand and annual consumption because demand is constant and consumption is constant. So, I will use annual consumption rather annual demand. Please correct this. Uh, instead of D5, use D7 and uh, D8. The same is applied here in case of MB. Instead of F5, Please use F8, but uh, resulting figure is same. Now come to the stock out cost. Stock out cost is here. I have doubt here. If someone is clear about this point, please um, mention in comment section with your suggestion or uh, any opinion. So I am going to take this value as it is from the given information stock out cost in terms of unit as it is 18 and 16. Now safety stock. First understand the what is safety stock. Safety stock is used in the situation where uh, demand is uh, also demand is constant or demand is in variation and the lead time is constant or lead time is in variation position and demand is constant or uh, maybe demand and constant both variate, va variate. But in case of firm, 
here everything is constant so there is no need of safety stock but I am going to be calculate as the instruction of the question so how I will find it this one I am going to tell you here is the formula for calculating this 0 0.01 this is a stock or acceptance factor 0 0.011 for form A and then into square root of D13 and D13 13 is the consumption per period in case of form A is 9300 kg into D14 and D14 is the lead time and into D18 which is a EOQ economic order quantity so we will get 26.41 as a safety stock so safety stock basically is a cushion that is provided to an advantage to uh, use your existing stock in excess of the your the other level quantity if there is some uh, delay in lead time due to some other factors maybe strikes or uh, many many other factors are also there so safety stock is using as a cushion where the variation is too much here in here in our section variation is available according quantity demanded so that's why safety stock calculation is necessary for from B as per given conditions are uh, as well given situation and for form A in my opinion it is not applicable but I have to be calculated here this is 26.41 and in case of form B it is 30.067 now I am going to calculate EOP economic order uh, point it is uh, the submission of something uh, reorder point and plus safety stop so what is the formula for uh, EOP let's I will go to the sheet one to show you the formula this is the formula EOP economic order point is equal to SL plus F square root SL into EOQ so S is the consumption per period L is equal to lead time F star code acceptance factor EOQ economic order quantity Come back to our sheet pin 6 is 2 to put the related values into the formula here is EOP and you see D13 D14 which is consumption per period and lead time plus D15 D15 is stock out acceptance factor 0 0.011 into square root D13 which is consumption period and D14 is the lead time and D8 is the EOQ economic order quantity so by clicking enter I will get this value and in case of from B I will get this value so now come to the part B on the basis of EOQ I have to decide which firm is good firm, for from A the EOQ is better because it is not seasonally, seasonal, there is no variation in demand, demand remains constant, lead time remains constant. So predictability about the reorder level is highest. At the end, I request all of you if you find some mistake regarding calculation or regarding uh, concepts, please come up with your uh, suggestion and with your own concepts by dropping in comment section. I will appreciate your cooperation in this regard. Thanks for watching. Assalamualaikum.